Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing an irresistible me hair extension review slash demo for you guys. And right here I'm just showing you what comes in the box. This is the little container that holds your hair. This first side is the tester strip that it comes with but I took it out. And then the big side is for all the hair and my puppy is crying right now. So yes, that's the little container that it comes with and then you get this right here, which is the back side, it just says irresistible me, extensions, directions, you know the drill. So yes, and then you get a hairnet, but I will just get on with the video. Here we go! So this is what my hair looks like natural. It's naturally straight. I did blow dry it, so this is second day old hair and it is pretty straight um i just use a blow dryer to blow dry it extra straight but this is pretty much what it looks like if i don't do anything with it it's pretty long it goes pretty much down past it's almost to my belly button so for these extensions i did get 240 grams of hair and that is the most that you can get on the website so that is what i got because i want the most hair possible since i am going for thickness not length so that is what i got and i also got that much because i felt like it would be easier to blend all my natural hair with that since i felt like i just felt like that would be easier to do to blend so yeah that's what i got and then one of the key features with these hair extensions is it comes with a four weft a piece with the what's different about this one is this is like really thick it's a really thick weft so you get all of this hair that is just one weft and that is it's the thickest one so this would go at the bottom of your layers of hair when you put this in and it comes with four clips like that and this is really thick so this is like a lot of hair I feel like so you could definitely probably just use this if you wanted just a little bit of thickness within your hair like if you're doing a ponytail or something you could definitely just use this and I feel like that would be sufficient enough you also get other pieces so you get one with the four wefts two little mini ones for the, I would say I put these on the side of my hair when I put them in so you get two little mini ones four um two clip ones which that's a lot I feel like so I put this I kind of make a four clip weft when I put this in my hair so I just put them in like two and two on the back of my head so that makes it a really thick like line of hair then I feel like that works really well with me you also get two three clips pieces which is also really nice which I put like kind of in a row too so you can basically make three rows of hair on your head which is really good for blending and it makes your hair super thick and full and makes you have like a lion's mane it's amazing so yeah those are what you get in the package those are the clipping ones and I actually really like the clips I didn't have any problems with the clips they went in my head really easily I didn't even have to tease my hair to make them stay in they just stayed really well without me doing anything anything um my hair was kind of dirty the last time I did it so maybe that's why they stayed in really well but if you have thinner hair than me you might want to tease them just to get a little bit more grip for the clips to stay in your hair so the reason why I wanted these hair extensions was so I could have some more volume with my hair because this side is way thinner than this side because I part my hair to this side so I have all the hair on this side I also got the platinum blonde color in these hair extensions if you guys are wondering so yeah let's just jump on into the tutorial so we are just gonna be um, combing our hair out first to get all the knots out and then I'm gonna be sectioning my hair I am just doing it pretty messy so I'm just gonna put a little section on the back because this is where most of your hair is gonna go so I'm putting the four weft clip on the bottom because most of your hair is gonna be covering that so that's why I put that one first and you want the most hair on the bottom and this was actually really good for the length wise and the clips were really easy to clip into my hair I didn't have any problems and then I'm just sectioning my hair out again and then I'm gonna be using the three weft clip ones and I am just gonna be putting two wefts and I'm kind of putting one on the right side and I'm gonna be putting another one on the left side and kind of sort of overlapping them just to make another line of hair and then I am gonna be turning around and I am gonna be starting my I guess sides of my hair and then I'm gonna be using the two clip weft one and I'm just gonna be placing these kind of random without within my hair just kind of putting them really consistently on the side because I felt that 
two lines of hair on the back was sufficient enough for me, so I wanted to um, really get everything all ready for the sides. Because that's where I need, I feel like, the most thickness is my sides, obviously, because that's where your hair is thinnest. So yeah, I'm just putting a one clip one there, and then we are going to be putting another one right there on the sides, because those fit nicely there. And then I am, again, just putting some more random like, and just kind of trying to make them blend as easy as possible. So yeah, that's just what I'm doing. And that's just a two clip one right there. And then I am going to be putting some more on that side because I just wanted to. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And then I'm just going to be br brushing everything out, teasing it a little bit, trying to get it all blended. And I'm just pretty much just going to be messing with it and getting it just the way I like it. So that's pretty much what it looks like. And I really like it. This is kind of like how I wear my hair when I wear my hair down. So this is just like my usual hairstyle and that's what it looks like on the ends. Just teasing a little bit to get it more blended. And this color really I felt like matched my hair. It gave me that extra kind of lightness that I have been recently wanting within my hair because I felt like my hair has been seeming a little bit dark. So I, this really actually made me really happy and made my hair feel a little bit lighter, I guess. So more of a pop. So that's what the back looks like. I have a ton of hair now. It's really awesome. I was trying to get, it's hard to see the back of your head, so I was trying to get it all blended together so you couldn't see any clips. And yeah, so that's what that looks like. And then I'm actually gonna be showing you a different look that I wanted to try with these hair extensions. And I'm actually gonna be using this necklace that I've had for a while now. And it's actually really pretty. I got it from Forever 21. And I thought it would be like a really pretty kind of like crown. So I parted my hair down the middle, I'm um, teasing the back a little bit, almost sneezed there, and then uh, yeah, I'm just teasing the sides, and then I'm going to be taking this necklace, and I'm just going to be using bobby pins, and you're going to want this to be already clipped on the back, just clip it so it's like a necklace, and then I'm just using two bobby pins, and I'm just bobby pinning the chain into my hair, and it worked pretty well, I felt. I felt like it looked pretty nice, and then I'm just going to be adjusting the top part, trying to make it look clean slash still kind of uh, big. Here's the finished look. I hope you guys like this. I really actually really really like these hair extensions. They pretty much match my hair pretty well except for this little chunk right here because I need to finish getting all of my hair blonde but basically other than that this matches my hair color like perfect and it actually I feel like it brightens up my hair because my hair has been I feel like personally not as bright as I want it and this definitely helped and I really like them they're super soft they definitely blend into my hair pretty much perfect I feel like I mean you guys can be the judge but yeah I really really like these they are really soft and smooth, which I love, and the clips went onto my head really well. They don't feel uncomfortable at all yet. I'm not used to them though, so I'm sure if I, well, I wore them out before, like for a long period of time, my head did start to hurt, but I'm sure once I wear them more and more, my head will not hurt anymore. So yeah, and I just put this little necklace on because I thought it was super pretty for like a headband. So if you guys ever have really pretty statement necklaces and you don't know what to do with them, you don't want to wear them, but you think they're really pretty and you think that they might be a nice headband. Well, you should try it as a headband because it'll probably be really cool. Once again, I did get the 240 gram hair extensions in color platinum and in 24 inch. And also, I want to tell you guys that I actually have a code for you guys for 10% off on these hair extensions. And the code is Irresistible Nicole. The link will be down below in the description box so you guys can click that and you guys can get yourself a pair of really nice hair extensions. So yes, uh, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys like this video. Please give me a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And most importantly, don't forget to give me, um, uh, I was going to say give me another thumbs up because I can't think right now. But actually what I was going to say is you guys should hit the magical subscribe button. It'll be right here. Actually over here. It'll be over here. So click that and help me get to 60,000 subscribers. I'm currently trying to get there. So please help me get there by clicking this. I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Speaks grim, but there's air.